once a poor was traveling along. He was weary and tired, so heavy laden, tattered and torn. Then he cried for mercy. Could somebody help me? And just then he knew that Jesus came through with his saving grace. Covered by mercy, cleansed by the flow. Though my sins were scarlet, Jesus washed them whiter than snow. Mercy met grace. I was that sinner, wasting my life. Without a purpose, I had no direction and no open sight. Then I cried for mercy. Could somebody help me? And just then I knew that Jesus came through and saved me by grace. Covered by mercy, cleansed by the flow. Though my sins were scarlet, Jesus washed them whiter than snow. by mercy, cleansed by the flow. Though my sins were scarlet, Jesus washed them whiter than snow. There on the cross, He took my place when He cried, it's finished. Our sin debt was made, now we are free, forever saved. Mercy met grace. Now we are free, forever saved. Mercy met grace. Mercy met grace. Mercy met Hello, everybody. My name is Chris. I'm from Clarksville, Tennessee, and I'm a senior as well, studying studio art. Hello, church. I am a junior business management major from the hot and dry city of Phoenix, Arizona, and my name is Stephen Roy. And I'm Andrew Faulkner. I'm from Washington State, and I'm studying management and marketing. I'm all the way from South Korea. My name is Ye Sung, but you guys can just call me Carl. I'm currently a junior studying music education. This same Jesus who walked in Galilee, well now this same Jesus who talked beside the sea, well now this same Jesus by faith I have been told, this same Jesus will save your soul, well now this same Jesus who heard the Hebrew children, heard the Hebrew children down in Egypt land. This same Jesus will lift your burden. This same Jesus will take your hand. Well, now this same Jesus who walked in Galilee. Well, now this same Jesus who talked beside the sea. Well, now this same Jesus by faith I have been told. This same Jesus will save your soul. Well, now this same Jesus who locked the lion's jaw. Lock the lion's jaw down in Daniel's den. 
This same Jesus will lift your burdens. This same Jesus will be your friend. Well, now this same Jesus who walked in Galilee. Well, now this same Jesus who talked beside the sea. Well, now this same Jesus by faith I have been told. This same Jesus will save your soul. This same Jesus who walked in Galilee. This same Jesus who talked beside the sea. This same Jesus by faith I have been told. This same Jesus will save your soul. This same Jesus will save your soul. This same Jesus will save your soul. Isn't it so great knowing Jesus, knowing that the same Jesus that we just sang about, the same Jesus that we read in the Bible about, is the same Jesus that's still saving souls, still changing lives today. Every time we worship him, it's so wonderful to praise his name. Something that the Lord has been teaching me this year uh, during my junior year of college is to trust in his timing. So many times I find myself trying to take God's will and fit it into my life the way that I want it to fit, instead of trusting his perfect plan. And... The more I go through college, the harder it is to keep that in mind, that he knows my future, and he knows exactly where I'll be five, ten years down the road, and I can just put my trust in that. And that's a truth that he's been teaching me, and that I have learned to put my trust in him. Jesus, I am resting, resting in the joy of what Thou art. I am finding out the greatness of Thy loving heart. Thou hast bid me gaze upon Thee, and Thy beauty fills my soul. Yes, I rest in thee, beloved, know what wealth of grace is thine. Know thy certainty of promise, and have made it mine. Jesus, I am resting, resting in the joy of what thou art. Wonderful, infinite God, 
author of all that is good, faithful provider and giver of life, source of all power and love. Great is the Lord and most worthy of praise, refuge of strength to the end, righteous redeemer and mighty to save, he's the anchor of hope for the souls of men. Gracious, compassionate, merciful compassionate God, God beautiful Father, victorious Son, source of unchangeable light. Great is the Lord and most worthy of praise, refuge of strength to the end, righteous Redeemer and mighty to save, He's the anchor of hope for the souls of men. You are light in the dark, you are healing for the broken heart, you are home, you are light. for the lost, rock of salvation, remarkable love, Savior who died on the cross. Great is the Lord and most worthy of praise, refuge of strength to the end, righteous Redeemer and mighty to save, He's the anchor of hope for the souls of men. Souls of men. Amen. Love that song, Anchor of Hope. It's something that all of us need right now is that anchor. He's Jesus. Amen. He's the one that never changes, Amen. always stays the same. He's the anchor of hope for all of our souls. So comforted by that song every time I sing it. We need that anchor. There's a lot going on in our world, really. I was talking with uh, some people today, and really, watching the news, everything that's going on, there's a lot that's going on right now in our world that's causing distress and worry in my life and in your guys' lives. But we don't have to worry about that because of what Jesus has done for us. Think back to the last time that you thought about what Jesus did for you on the cross. Remember who you were. The sinner that you were, that I was. Remember what Christ did on the cross for all of us. Remember the joy and the peace that you felt knowing that you didn't have to work your way to heaven. Amen. When you think about that, everything else just kind of fades away in light of that, in light that we've been forgiven. It's just so thankful for that. We're going to sing about that truth in our next song as we sing the classic hymn at Calvary. I spent in vanity and pride, caring not my Lord was crucified, knowing not it was for me he died on Calvary. Mercy there was great and grace was free. Pardon there was Multiply to me. There, my burdened soul found liberty at Calvary. By God's word, at last my sin I learned. Then I trembled at the law I spurned. Sal. 
salvation's plan. Oh, the grace that brought it down to man. Oh, the mighty gulf that God did spend at Calvary. Mercy there was great and grace was free. Pardon there was multiplied to me. There my burdened soul found liberty at Calvary. a pastor's kid and the message of salvation was definitely no stranger to me um, I heard that message quite a bit and sadly over time that message did not mean that much to me and I kind of fought with my own I guess um, I, I fought with myself I thought that I was good enough to earn my way into heaven I thought that um, my prideful self there we go. My prideful self thought that um, because my family served in the ministry, because my dad was a pastor, and because we were so involved in the ministry, I thought that I was good enough to get into heaven. And I remember specifically, we had an evangelist come through our church, and he preached a, a series of messages. And during that week, the Lord really worked on my heart, and I came to realize um, what he really did for me. And... I remember at seven years old, <clears throat> bowing down, um, I remember accepting his free gift of salvation. And ever since that moment, I've known that my life is about the cross. Message I could bring you. There's no question it would be about the cross, about the blood, about the place I found God's mercy and love. And although it's bittersweet. Remembering the cause, there's something beautiful about the cross. I could sing about the state of grace I live in, or the peace and joy I have when times are tough. And you'd see in all the blessings I've been given. In the end, my life is just about the cross, about the blood, about the place I found, God's mercy and love. And although it's bittersweet, Remembering the cost, there's 
something beautiful about the cross. Two thousand years ago, if I had watched Christ die, I think I would have lost all hope, demanding to know why. But now I know His sacrifice means everything. And it's the greatest honor to see. About the cross, about the blood, about the place I found, God's mercy and love. And although it's bittersweet, remembering the cost, there's something beautiful. Cross.